Hey guys, what's up? It's Mobiltron, back out with another video, and in today's video we're going to be looking at the Ultimate Reckoning bundle in Fortnite. Um, just to kind of keep up with the more Halloween style skins, because there's so many of them in the shop. Um, as you can see, we have Nash, we have Violet, and we have Grave, which are the sort of counterparts to one of the done. Of, uh, it's Blacklight, Katrina, and Willow, I think. So, like, um, Blacklight was the only male skin in that last bundle, and Violet is the only female skin in this bundle. Just to kind of give them, like, couples vibes, if you will, or, you know, whatever. But, yeah. As always, if you like this, hit the like button, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell, and you guys know when I go live and when I upload all that good stuff. And yeah, so as with all these videos, I'm gonna go into the replays, go into creative mode, and just show them off. Pickaxes, back blings, whatnot. Though these bundles don't come with pickaxes, you know, I'll show uh, whichever one I currently have equipped, which. Nothing special, but yeah. Let's go. So, taking a look at our first skin of the Ultimate Reckoning bundle, um, we have Nash, which Nash obviously is the male, uh, na excuse me, male version of uh, Willow from the Ultimate or the Final Reckoning. Which, taking a look at him, you can see his face, very like emo-esque again. With like the the black stuff dripping from his eye there, um, you see his hair is all messy and whatnot as well. Um, on his pinstripe suit, which looks very awesome, he has a little like heart sewn into his thing there, which is very interesting. Um, you see his, the butt of his chest there has very interesting. Um, his hands are black, they're, you know, done black with the sort of goopy stuff hanging off again. voodoo doll style uh, doll of him which you can probably guess where this is going um, so, got a tape over one eye and then the big like uh, button for the other eye so to say he's lost one then he's got like the stitching and his pinstripes, pinstriped suit only for the shoes um, yeah so as you can guess, we've got a separate edit style for him, which we can go take a look at now in a moment whenever I get my camera set up again. And yeah, let's go take a look at his edit style. Let's go. And here we have his edit style, which if you if you did guess it, congrats. If you didn't, that's obviously still congrats for staying this long. Um, well, here we have his other style, which I think is actually called Cursed uh, Nash, instead of like just the doll head or whatever. But you can tell, obviously, with him being a male part or male version of Willow, he obviously gets the big doll head as well, which is a bit more like it's a part of him in comparison to Willow's because Willow's just like looked like a bag over her head is actually you know doesn't have the bottom of the bag around his neck or anything so it's very cool but you can see it's just the head is back bling but just massive at least bigger anyway with like the bit of tape over one side of the band-aid from another like this I'm not even sure what that is, with the big button sewn in and his mouth sewn as well. 
which if we turn around you see sort of how the hair matches up and whatnot from this angle which is very cool um yeah to my knowledge there is no other like changes that has been made to the skin like through his edits at all but yeah that is going to do it for nash let's go take a look at the next skin which i think it's katrina's other or her counterpart um yeah let's go take a look at that there go here we have the male version of katrina which honestly speaking i don't remember the name of this even though i said it in the intro um i'll potentially put it up in the corner somewhere if i haven't then I don't know I said, um, you know, but you see, obviously it's male version of Katrina from the last video, or at least the last review, which you can see, um, it's kind of got that Day of the Dead sort of skull design going on still, with the red and the green paint, very nicely done, um, you can see flowers around his neck and whatnot, like the little vines. He's got very like raven feathery shoulder pads, which are interesting. That's our black out leaves. Can do look with black out leaves. For his arms, he's obviously got um, the little flowers and more vines. His hands have like this, well, say the bones just instead of skin, just like Katrina. His jacket has different flowery sort of stuff on it with his pockets and then the same sort of bandolier going across his, the underneath of the coat which is very very nice looking um, for his bottom half you can see obviously same style but but different he's got a skull on his belt the little like uh things around his thigh and then instead of on the back of the boot, boots this time it's on the front of the boots it's just these little flowers which very very nice i really love the skin might honestly be one of my favorites like Loki obviously but, um, from the back you can see his back bling is practically the same as Katrina's just there's more bones to it than there is flowers flowers are kind of behind everything when the bones are more prominent this time which you see it's the spine with like extra bits and bobs coming out of it so yeah and you can even see like little bits of the vine coming out up from behind it and all as well very very nice but yeah that is going to be it for this skin again i really need to remember these the names of these skins better um but yeah let's go take a look at that's only his that i've forgotten as well which is really annoying but let's go take a look at violet which she is the male version or the female version of um black white from the last video Let's go do that. And here we have the final skin in this bundle, rocking the same pickaxe as her male counterpart. We have Violet, which, as I said, she is the male or the female, the female compartment or like component version of Blacklight. Um, counterpart is the word I was looking for again there. Which you can see, uh, her mask is half purple half pink with the more pink sort of fangs on the side beady white eyes this time instead of the glowing purple her torso uh, as you can see jacket her left hand side is now done in pink with the cage around the side when black lights was the other side along with the sort of skeletal bone coming down the forearm or the bicep even on the forearm um, she does have short sleeves on her jacket instead of the full like full arm the brown for the gloves very nicely done um, coming down to the leg she's she keeps the left leg as the skeletal side which very very nicely done um, coming down the back of the leg as well you can see that detailing and um, yeah take a look at the back wing and her back detailing see more of that spinal sort of design which I don't know where my camera doesn't want to focus properly on this but anyway you can see that and then the wings I nearly prefer these if they were a bit bigger but I still prefer these over Blacklight's wings just they look a lot cooler in my opinion 
they're very spiky and have like the extra bits of detailing like all or the extra bits like the silver stuff in here and whatnot it just looks fucking awesome and whatnot but yeah um and obviously again the pickaxe with the purple blade and whatnot very cool very have very trendy and all that good stuff so yeah that is going to be it for the ultimate reckoning bundle um yeah i don't know what else to say if you like this hit the like button share comment and subscribe hit the notification bell so you guys know when i live and when i upload all that good stuff and yeah hopefully the next video is not fortnite related but knowing my luck it probably will be um i am trying to record more than just fortnite today while i have time today being saturday because this may be my only chance to get shit done for the first time, you know, properly for a while. So, I'm trying to get what I can done. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon. Goodbye.